Science Inc. This is my show. And today I'm going to uh, A your cues. I'm going to answer your questions. Scott McGowan asked me two things. One, what comic book would I love to be written into? Wolverine and the X-Men. Jason Aaron's my favorite and I love that book. And what did you do before chosen as Marvel's hot redhead for the watch her? I mean, watcher. Uh, I see what you did there. Well, I don't think that my role is actually considered hot redhead. I think uh, my actual job description is to be the writer and host of the show. Uh, but before this, I worked as a comedian primarily and a marketing manager. Mystery solved. Andrew Demestra's what is that last name? No offense, man, but that's a crazy last name. Ask me, how did you get your job at Marvel? I got my job at Marvel because I was producing my own weird video content of just like me talking about whatever, comics, nerdy stuff. And when they needed a new host, I got a random email from the head of Marvel asking me if I would like to come in to audition and I did and it went well and the rest as they say is her story if you're a feminist or probably an annoying hippie. Sunshine Thor 420 asked me if you had a date with any one superhero who would it be? Kitty cat smiley face. But I feel like I would have to go on a date with Steve Rogers for the following reasons. He's tall. He's dreamy and you know he would be such a gentleman open the door for you and pay for your dinner and be like chivalrous and like call you ma'am i don't know that does it for me somehow judge away world Ooh, but then you would never make out because he'd probably make you wait like 25 dates to just like kiss on the mouth see i wouldn't want to go out with tony stark because he'd be a womanizer I definitely wouldn't go out with deadpool i kind of would like to go out with ben Grimm also because like doesn't Ben Grimm deserve like a really nice date? Oh, or Beast. Oh, I could go out with Hank McCoy. I might have a, like a Florence Nightingale complex. Gatman 1962 asked me, it might be early to tell, but will you be, will you still be doing stand-up in August as I'll be in New York then? I have never done stand-up, so no. I do, I do do improv and I do do sketch. <laughs> do do. Wanky YT! What a sex name. Wanky? Yikes. What age were you when you got interested in comedy? Uh, I've always been interested in comedy. My mom thought I was funny when I was like a toddler, so that pretty much like cemented that I liked being laughed at. A Sonic Lord 73 asked me, do you like any heroes from DC or just Marvel? Yes, I do. Calador CP asked me, uh, what's it like doing The Watcher? Do you write your own stuff? Do you work with the team, etc.? So this is the basic process of the show. I send out an email to a whole bunch of people that are in PR, and then they tell me if there are any underground tips uh, about the news that has not come out yet. And I write the show. I read all the comics. I choose the comics that I want to review that week. I write about those comics. I write about whatever news may be going around or things that I just find are interesting. And then I go in, I shoot it on Tuesdays with my awesome video crew. And then we spend the rest of the week editing it. I do the initial edits and I work with other people to do the motion graphics. But all in all, I'm basically, that show is pretty much me and my awesome producers. Uh, so I'm very lucky to get to do as much of that show as I get to do which is awesome. BenderGod82 asked me, are you single? What are your hobbies? And you definitely rock the superhero shirts. Basically, when I'm not looking at stuff about comics or movies or other random nerdery, like playing Magic the Gathering, uh, I'm at comedy shows, because those are my two passions. Nerdery and comedy. They go hand in hand, I think. It's like they scissor. Like they group scissor. Lee Ganyan left me a question. Favorite doctor from Doctor Who? Um, my favorite doctor, ugh, you guys, not interesting, David Tennant, but come on, like, I love him. I think there's one last question. Ugh, this is from Jimmy Aquino from Comic News Insider. You son of a gun. He asked, what's my favorite number? Seven. Okay, guys, thanks for watching this episode. Thank you for asking me questions. If you have more questions, ask them. I might answer them another day. So that's fun. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!
ับแล้วแบบบ๊ายบาย